So Jesse, what does what does Lincoln mean to, to you and to and to the riders? Uh, well, I think it obviously means a lot to Britain. I think it's one of the mm. biggest races in Britain, probably like a monument um, for me. Uh, I just think it's the atmosphere. You don't get that at any other race, um, and that I wasn't expecting that last you just, year. You don't mind suffering like on that, that those cobbles yeah. with all these people yeah. watching. I, I mean, particularly the last time up that uh, up Michael Gate, the crowds were just insane. You could hear people screaming and um, banging on the sideboards. It was just yeah. incredible. It definitely carries you up there. Uh, just a great a great atmosphere and I don't think there's any other race quite like that in, in the UK that I've seen anyway. And I guess being on a podium, it's ten times as good. Yeah, yeah, well, uh, <laughs> yeah, that was amazing. Um, I didn't realise um, at the time that I'd ridden myself into a podium position. I thought I might have got, got myself into top ten, so I was really chuffed to have been in the top ten and then when I crossed the finish line and was told oh actually you came third you know <laughs> that was just insane amazing yeah and you're from the Isle of Man yeah yes from the Isle of Man so you have to struggle yeah. I know I know people like Dr Tilbury and all that oh, yeah. who, who are always traveling backwards and forth to the mainland yeah it's quite a quite a thing to do isn't it, it yeah it is hard especially um so you've got a three or four hour boat and then for Lincoln in particular it's a good four hour drive down so it's a long weekend and um, like this race this weekend although it's only an hour off the boat it's it's a flying visit um, I came over yesterday morning was it yesterday morning and then uh, I'm back back from Liverpool tomorrow uh, not tomorrow tonight so. I understand the weather can be uh interesting on the boat. yeah and um, yeah I so mean, you're used to this we, yeah i'm used to it it doesn't make it any more enjoyable to, to <laughs> ride your racing um but yeah it's a little bit warmer over here than it is at home so hopefully well it's been a pretty long winter so hopefully we'll get a good good summer for it so, so but the next time we're going to see you on uh, here we'll be at, at lincoln yeah, next time I move, we'll be two weeks. Yeah, yeah, two weeks time. So uh, yeah, we'll see that. Going in there with a bit more confidence now. Um, hopefully, yeah, we'll have to see. Yeah. How big? How how strength? What's the strength in depth like with the women's race? Because it looks quite big. Um, back at home, or you know, just just the potential for the, yeah. for the podium. Or something. Oh yeah, I, I mean, I think there already seems to be. A, a bigger field of stronger. I'm like, 47. Wow. Oh, is it? Wow. So I've never heard of um, a peloton that big. So wow. for women, anyway. So yeah, that's great. It's great to see the women's peloton getting bigger and also stronger in depth as well. Like so. So it's, a, uh, it's going to be a good weekend, let's hope. Fingers yeah, crossed. fingers crossed. Yeah, we'll see what happens. Right. Thanks. Well done.